Because the January jobs report is out and it far exceeded expectations. Business correspondent Marley Caden is breaking down the numbers. And I like that you have some good news to cover here. I do, Adrian. The Labor Department says that payrolls rose by 467,000 in January, despite experts forecasting a significantly lower growth of only 150,000. The U.S. employment rate edged just slightly higher to 4%. Now, analysts were prepared for the weakest reading since the end of 2020, so much so that the White House even warned people not to put too much weight on this particular report. As you can see on your screen, that concern was unwarranted. Now that said, we should explain why there was so much worry. The survey was taken during the second week of January when Omicron was rampant. Because of this, employees who stayed home but did not receive sick pay were not counted as employed in this report. That includes anyone who got COVID, was worried they might get sick, had to isolate, or had to take care of someone who was ill. And even with all of those workers excluded the numbers are still very encouraging. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.